Well, I'm back at um, level four of Meta Nightmare Ultra, which is um um what's it called? Meta Knight's Re the Revenge of Meta Knight or something like that, I think. I don't know, but we're on Meta Knight's ship. So let's go ahead and just watch the cutscene again. It's probably just the same. I just don't know why Meta Knight would go onto his ship and destroy his own. I really don't know why, but I guess that's what he does. So, yeah. Alright, so I have zero, um, sword points, I guess is what you could call them. I really don't know what they're actually called. I just call them sword points. And I only got three lives since I actually did, um, save and quit, so... Everything is starting to quickly get two star points and make a partner now. And, alright, let's get going here. I'm not really, I'm just gonna like, you know, this is just basically speeding through this place. Because, <clears throat> I mean, you're going through it twice in here. Well, this is Heavy Lobster, and of course he is the, um, person you fight before, um, the ship takes off, which I believe the ship will take off any time now. I don't think you fight him fully. Well, I think actually, man, right now, so you do kill him before the ship flies off, so. Whoa! Mini lobster there got me, alright, for the kill. Yeah, so. And then just wraps us to the next chapter. And you can even see the ship in the background. So, yeah, I'm actually kind of glad there's nothing to collect here. And I don't have much health left, so I'm gonna go head and heal. And okay, we got a mini boss to fight here. And pretty easy, I would say. Not many bosses really aren't too hard. They give you like I think they give you ten sword points, I'm pretty sure, enough to heal yourself. I know the actual bosses give you twenty. So that's almost enough to get a match tornado. Ah, oh, jeez, I didn't heal myself again. Not right now, but I, guess I think there's actually some food items here you can get, yeah. So I'm not worried about healing right now. Alrighty, so... Oh, good. An auto skull screen here. <sighs> My favorite. Like, I really hate them. And whoa! That stupid fish was right there. Okay. I got enough sword points to heal myself right when I get another hit on me. Because then I'll probably be down in the. Uh... Well, I can't call it the red zone because my entire HP is red. I guess on low health, I should say. Alright, come on. Oh, great. The spike dot. Area. I think I really should heal right just about now because my partner. Oh yeah, I'm good. I don't care if I get hit by the spikes. Oh crap. Go inside the door. Alright, looks like we get the boss here now. Let's go ahead and face Whiskey Woods again. But remember this boss, um you can fight Whiskey Woods and then you fight Tony Woods. Well that attack does a lot of damage, so maybe slice your sword up. And now it's time to fight Tim Woods. Alrighty, so just get rid of that one, and now... My partner takes the damage from the apples. At least that's good, and they're good. Alright, so... After this, um, rap start here, will just take us into the forest. I believe it doesn't show a cutscene when we go back onto my night ship, because... It just doesn't. Yep, see now in the forest. Alright. At least this isn't the annoying fort. At least this isn't the annoying place. And whatever area it was again. I think it was King Diddy's Revenge. And that's ain't the right way. Ah! 
Happy Bird Juniors on apples. I guess that's what you they are. Alright, we should get a couple of mini bosses here, and they're both bonkers, so. Whoa! Oh, I thought I was going to take care of him. Oh, well, that does. And since our sword acts as like a hammer, we can just like hammer everything. Like, see, it, it's actually. It's like our sword is a hammer, I guess. Our sword is basically everything. It can light stuff, it can reach far areas like the beam casting can. So, yeah, it's basically. It's actually like the best sword, the gold sword, I would say. But uh, obviously it's Mennonite, so. Anyway, I don't know why Mennonite has the name Mennonite, because what he actually is, is he's a Kirby. Like, you know the um, colors of Kirby's like the uh, pink Kirby, which is the one you play as? Why didn't I jump there? And you know, green, red, and yellow Kirby. Which you can actually get access to those guys in, um... I'm not sure which game it was. I think it was, um, it's Kirby um, in the Amazing Mirror. Yeah, that one. This Meta Knight is actually blue Kirby. Except he's just under some armor and he's got an awesome weapon. And he doesn't puff the fly, he uses a cape. So he's better. He's better than all the original Kirby's, except Kirby can still destroy Meta Knight. Alright, uh, I believe that's a fake, so don't do that. Uh, see, it lights that. I mean, this is the real one and my partner is left behind, but don't worry. Whenever your partner leaves behind, he always comes back to you. So now we're back on the ship, and... I'm not sure if this is the chapter where you fight the, uh... Cannon or whatever, but... I'm gonna go and ride this thing. Whee! Whoa, be careful there. That might actually kill you. If you're not careful. Uh, don't ride on that one. It's just a trap. So, I've actually... Um, it doesn't, I've actually, um, it could kill you, but I've never been killed by that trap. I've just ran into it so much times because I think it's the right way, but it's not. So, we got some of, you know, Mennonite's minions, I guess you could call them, the guards. And we got some more of them. Hooray. Stab attack. Oh, stab into the ground attack. But it still works very well. Alrighty. Yeah, turtle. Plasma whisk. Alrighty. So let's get on up here and... Ah, I hate those turtles. So there's no way to kill those turtles, and I don't like that. I wish you could kill at least every enemy in the game by doing it somewhere. Alright, so we got Poppy Bro Jr. and this guy here, which I really don't know what his name is. And, ooh, I'm gonna die. See, there's someone who... Heal myself up real quick, and alright, that psychic guy is dead. I guess you want to call him psychic guy, but I really honestly don't know what he is. How did I do that? I don't know. Alright, here's the main cannon number two, that is. It's not number one, this is number two. How am I trying to get. What? I got hit by it? Oh well. For some reason, whenever your face, I just really want to get rid of that. I want to get rid of this part of the cannon because it's just so annoying. It takes a lot to get rid of it too. There we go. Oh, my partner is actually almost dead here, so I think next hit for each of us. I'm going to restore half here. Oh, my partner already died, so... There we go. So the main cannon is destroyed. And I believe we're at the final part here. Whoa, that laser guy shot out a bunch of lasers. I don't have a partner, so I'm, I'm actually going to go ahead and make a partner since I got 50 sword points. And I'm gonna go quick actually because I feel like it. Quick Meta Knight! Still gonna hurt though. Quick! Woohoo! 
can like see the night shadows. You can see like so cool going quick. But it eventually wears off though. Oh! I thought that wild dude was gonna knock me off in the corner and I was gonna die, but no, I didn't die from that. Huh. Alright, so we got Mr. Frosty here to battle. Which is probably one of the three easiest boss the other ones being. I'm sure the Poppy Bro Junior the Poppy Bro Senior is really easy. I'm not sure who the other one was that I said. Oh well. Just hurry up through these ducks, because I really want to get done with this in one episode. Still got five minutes, so. Well, actually, more like four and a half, I'd say. Alright, we're real quickly just getting to the end of this. Here's the actual battle with Heavy Lobster. And there's no way to hurt him when you're on the auto screen. You gotta wait until he's up there. I really don't think we're gonna finish this in this episode, though. Oh, shoot. Uh, going the wrong way there for a second. I thought that was going to cost me. Nope, this is the end right here. So, wait for the other scroll to go up. And Heavy Lobster's stuck there until we get to the top. So, that's good. Unless you don't get smushed in between those, you'll be fine. Just make sure you don't stand on here for too long, because then he'll come. I don't know why he started going back and just hit forward. I know he's going to jet. Heavy Lobster's got a lot of attacks. So, let's see, whoa, I didn't expect that to happen, but still, he's, like, he's, like, he's kind of slow, but when he uses his engine, I guess, in the back where the blue flames come out, it's actually really fast. So, okay, where's the door? Um, whoa, I almost died there, but <laughs> I was actually, I got enough time to, um, actually get it on my cape, so stupid plasma wisp and I swear those things look like shoes with hats on or something. Alrighty. I don't think we're gonna get done with this in this episode, but I didn't plan on it because this is a really long game actually. Well you know, the whole game overall is the longest game. Like Mana Nightmare Ultra? Because it's got every single level in it. Um, okay, you can't go down here actually yet. You gotta go over here. And wait for this. No, hit this switch right there. And then I'll launch it. Alright, so now we go down here. And the one up right there, there used to be a yo-yo costume, but not anymore. Um, so... You can actually access what's in here, which is actually the secret stash of food in one of what Captain, uh, well, not what Captain Zwolf said, I think was one of his minions, but, uh, that's what he says, he's like, my secret stash is a food in one ups. well, what's he gonna use one ups for? He can't really use one ups anyway. Alright, I think I have enough time to defeat the reactor here. So, uh, maybe not having a partner is a good idea. There we go. Partner's dead now, so, crap. Shoot the reactor. Yeah, okay. I don't think there's any way to get rid of that. The uh, blaster and the reactor, so just don't worry about it. That thing that's fighting out right now, yeah. You don't want to get hit by that either. That's actually very dangerous. You could destroy that cannon thing. Or the thing that foot shoots lasers out of the reactor. But it'll just come back. See, you can get two star points for it. Whoa! Good thing that gives you a lot of time. It gives you a heads up on, hey, I'm gonna hit you. So, last of the reactor, yeah. Alright. And, oh, that's actually the end of this game. So, yeah, just in time. Man, I got like half, half a minute left, too. So, that's it, once again. A man in a ship gets brought down by his own self that time, so. No, but, you know, nobody's in it except the stupid waddle bees and stuff, but who cares about them? There are millions of them in the game anyway. So that's the end of that game, and we got level 5 up next. And level 5 is Milky Way Wishes, the very last one. Alright, so I'll do that one next episode. I'm not gonna get it all done, but I will try to get as much done as I can. Alright, so I'll see you everybody next episode.